Hello, and welcome to the Synopsys Optical Solution Group training series. In this Light Tools video, I will show you how to add a retroreflective optical property. A retroreflector is a component or film that directly reverses incident light. This is different than a normal reflector where the incident and reflected angles are the same but mirrored around the surface normal. In Light Tools, you add a retroreflector as an optical property. In the Optical Property Manager, select New, then Load from Library, Surface Finishes, Retroreflector.1.opr. At this point, you can apply this property to any surface in Light Tools. In this model, there is already a fan of rays and a lens component with a spline patch surface. When I change the optical property of the lens rear surface to the retroreflective property, all rays are reversed. It's a little tricky to tell since they are returned the exact same path as the initial rays. However, let's look at the ray properties. In the Ray Data tab, pay attention to the optical direction cosines in the absolute coordinate system. There are two segments for each ray, and each segment has M and N components that are equal but opposite. This indicates the ray is simply being reversed. For more, including steps on adding non-ideal retroreflective components, see the retroreflector example in the Light Tools example model library. Thank you for your attention, and if you have further questions, please contact us at lighttools underscore support at synopsis.com.